IPA family. It's your boy L A P A. You guys already know what it is, man. We're on here trying to uh, get the youngsters to uh, get out the system, not to go to the system, the reoffenders to stay out the system. You guys already know, man. This is my second channel. Um, my first ta channel obviously was a lot bigger than this one. We had to start over because, you know, shit happened. It is what it is. But my point with doing this one, man, as you can tell by the good old caption that Unia, that thumbnail, 916, man, 916. Uh, what is, what's, what's, hold on. Uh, man, I forgot his name. Anywho, the cat was in 60 days in, man. And uh, I had seen Flacco's content, man. And, and disclaimer, I ain't doing this for Flacco or anything else. I'm doing this, and you guys will see exactly why I'm doing this as this video progresses. Um, I mean, I was chilling, willing and dealing right here. You guys already know. Um, working on other content. And I seen, uh, I seen, uh, um, oh, shout out to OG, Triple OG, man. I seen one of his drops on that cat. And, oh, Dirty Weather, Dirty Weather 916. There you go. That's when I figured that, because I was trying to look for him when I see the reaction on him, uh, on Flacco. And I was like, Flacco, who is this cat? And all he told me was like, oh, he was in 60 days in. I was like, oh, okay, cool, you know. I seen the reaction uh, 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 that Flacco did to him, but I couldn't find the other cat's reaction. So it wasn't until OG did the reaction or did a little video on him. I was like, oh, that's his name. So I looked him up. I found his content, and I seen that dude's reaction to Flacco. And, uh, <laughs> man, bro, like, first of all, man, this is what I see. Dirty Weather 916, right? uh cladell or some some something like that i don't know what his name is uh i personally have nothing against the cat um but one thing i will say is this i seen that this dude pretty much called for help uh, uh on 60 days in two cats were fighting this dude was damn near out of breath he called them. I don't know if that was the cue because I I've seen sixty days in. There's usually a cue. You look into the camera, and that's when the producers pull you out of there. What I didn't know was that this dude did twenty years. No, I'm assuming since he knows about Selena's Valley and the reaction that he did a Flacco's video, I'm assuming that he did his time in California. And if you did your time in California, man, I don't give a fuck how old you are, bro. Especially if you did twenty years. If you volunteer to go into 60 days in and then one single little bullshit ass fade, one little fight. County jail, bro. County jail, man. You know how many fights I was in the county jail? How many foods we smashed on? I was, I seen more action in the county jail. Actually, probably as much action as I seen in the, in the county jails in prison. And I was just unlucky to do so because I went to a gang of prisons, all the level fours. Um, so I know the county jail could crack. For anybody out here thinking that the county jail is no thing, bro, the county jail be cracking. So I don't know if this cat 916 went in the county jail, wherever the fuck he did. I haven't seen the episode. I just seen that clip. But the clip speaks for itself. I don't know where he did his time, but like, bro, like, one fight, one fight was enough for you to go call for help. So they could pull you out of there. And that fool was like, man, I did 20 years, but I don't know, man. I don't know about this. I was like, no, man, say it ain't so. It just didn't make no damn sense to me. You know what I'm saying? So this is my point. You're sitting here politicking, bro, on YouTube, right? And like you said, YouTube, you're only one phone call away. Okay, I get it. Um, not saying that you won't handle your business. Maybe you would, you know? I'll venture to say that I don't think you would because of what I've seen about you in 60 Days In. You know what I'm saying? If anything, you should have been a leader. You should have been a leader in that motherfucking pod. Maybe because you're from California and you told them that and you did your time somewhere else. I don't know where they sent you. Maybe you didn't have no say so. I don't know. I'm just trying to give you the benefit of the doubt, bro. But from what I've seen, man, this fool embarrassed the fuck out of California. He embarrassed the shit out of himself. Um, I just don't understand how somebody like this thing feels like they could still have a podcast. I mean, you can have a podcast regardless on anything, right? 
But I don't know how he feels that he could respond to Flacco's uh, 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 videos like he has any say so. You know what I'm saying? Like, like he's somebody like, like he has any type of credibility after that shameful performance that you did on 60 Days In. You know what I'm saying? Um, I think any one of us that would go on 60 Days In would probably perform better than him. You know what I'm saying? And he wasn't involved in the fight. That's the crazy part, bro. Like, two dudes were fighting and shit. It was just one simple fight. And and he basically pieced it up. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, like real PC up. You know what I'm saying? Like, some of us went to the side because of other reasons. It wasn't because our, it wasn't because our lives were in danger immediately or nothing like that. It was just because we got tired of the shit, you know? But this dude fucking pretty much PC'd up after 60 days in. Uh, nobody was suspectful. Nobody was suspecting him. Uh, I could be wrong. I, I, You know, I'm, I'm a firm believer in context. I'm a firm believer, and there's always two sides to a story. And albeit I have not seen the whole series or that season or that episode for that matter. I know that what I've seen was more than enough for me to be to convince me that this dude is soft as hell, you know. I'm not sitting here trying to disrespect the cat. I'm just going off of what I've seen. And the audacity of this cat to try to react to Flacco's video, trying to say that he's out of pocket, trying to say that he was spinning a narrative, and, and so on and so forth. To me, it's like, bro, like, let's just say that's the case, right? Let's just say that's the case and Flacco was spinning a narrative, right? Flacco was just going off of what he's heard. Uh, things like that, right? And he's already reacted to it, like I said. You know what I'm saying? Um, and even I had a few, like, kind of like, not disagreements with Flacco's video, but like, kind of like, well, how do we know this for sure type shit? You know what I'm saying? Like, not going against him, but just like, let's do a little more research type stuff. This dude was outright, like, disagreeing with them. And he could do that. Everybody has the right to voice their opinion, just like I do. And that's what I'm doing. Um, but yeah, to me, like the point of this video is like, bro, like, <laughs> bro, like, how do you expect anybody to take you serious? Speaking on some prison genre shit, right? When you couldn't even hang with a simple county jail fight in whatever state you were in. Because I know it wasn't, I, I don't, I don't think they have 60 days in in California. I don't think. I don't, yeah, I, I don't think that they would even bring it to California because if you bring 60 days into California, bro, I don't think they'll survive. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, California is just volatile, bro. And I'll venture to say that Texas is the same way and maybe New York. Who knows? Um, I'm talking about structured states, states that don't fuck around. You know what I'm saying? Um, so, yeah, man, I just, like I said, man, I, I looked at it. I finally found out who he was, and I seen that, and I was just like, damn, bro. Shout out to OG once again, man. Gracias for, for dropping that video. Uh, not because you were necessarily going in on him, on 916, but because at least that told me who that dude was. And now I'm able to do this video and, and, and be like, <laughs> are you serious, bro? Like, are you serious, dog? You know, I hope he doesn't react to this shit because I honestly ain't going to respond to him. I could care less. But anybody that's watched 60 Days In, uh, First 48, things like that, man, come on, man. Like, if you're going to go on there, bro, like, represent, bro. Whether you're from Chicago, New York, fucking Florida, Texas, Cali, Washington, Oregon, anywhere, 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 bro. Like, come on, man, you can't roll it up off the first little fight that you see, bro. Like, come on, man. Like. And the reason I say that it's not because I'm glorifying it and because I I, I I condone violence. It's just that if you feel like you have what it takes to go into that type of environment, obviously it's a show, right? And obviously you don't have to put up with that shit. You're there voluntarily. Trust me, I get it, man. You're there voluntarily. Um, once shit gets real, you're like, oh, shit, I'm gone. Man, bro, come on, cut it out, bro. At least stay. At least stay. I could understand if it was directed towards you and motherfuckers wanted to blast you and beat your ass up. I get that part, bro. Even then, I'll still get mines. 
You know what I'm saying? Especially if I signed up for this shit. If somebody else gets in a fight and you roll it up, <laughs> I'm, I'm, this is why I did this video, man, because uh, it's just another lesson. It's just another lesson for the youngsters or any reoffenders out there once again. Don't you ever think that you're going to go into 60 days in and give this type of performance like it, it, it's just like if you're there you're there for a reason so at least represent for yourself you know like would i be okay with uh you going in there and being a boss and, and getting down with dudes and potentially catch more time not necessarily you know if that's your if that's your prerogative that's your prerogative you know what i'm saying but there has to be a reason why you're going in there right there has to be a reason why you're going in there right um, but if you think you're badass and you're not, don't talk a good one. Don't be on YouTube talking about other dudes are fucking up, spinning narratives and shit like that. You know what I mean? Stay in your lane. That's basically what I'm saying. You don't have to listen to me. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying this is my opinion. With all due respect to the cat, but he, uh, he definitely embarrassed himself. That's for damn sure. You know, and, and hey, for all intents and purposes, this is just a video. It is what it is. That being said, hit the like, hit the subscribe button, man. Drop a comment if you guys liked it. Drop a comment regardless. Share the video, guys. I love you guys. My APA family. One life saved is one life blessed. A smart man learns from his mistakes, but a wise man learns from other people's mistakes. You guys be good. I'm outie.